Welcome back everyone to the second Bernie's Brace fundraiser. So the first one went fantastic, was able to uh, do some tin packages and raise enough money to buy Bernie's first brace. Um, now it's working out great and I'm hoping at the end of this video to be able to catch some footage of him running around with it. Um, but we've noticed that, uh, I mean, he's a kitten. Um, not only is he growing, but he is very active. And he's already pulled out of his brace twice where we thought we had actually lost it. So I have a feeling um, there probably will be some point where he loses his brace and we have to replace it. Uh, but then there's also the concern of him getting bigger, him wearing uh, this one out. All sorts of things can go on. So... Uh, I figured I would do another kind of package uh, deal to try and take advantage of some shipping rates and try and give you guys a good deal at the same time. So as you can see, I have five binders, and these binders have been for sale for a while. Um, they're, they're all kind of damaged in some way, um, and I can give specifics, but you can see with the darker eye binder, um, there's some, uh, some pen marks there at the top. Uh, this one technically um, is in the best condition. I've actually been using this uh, even lately for trade binder updates. We have some tearing up here, but it's not an actual Pokemon uh, binder. It just has a bunch of Pokemon stickers. Um, and he, I could probably get my name off of it with, uh, with alcohol, um, rubbing alcohol. But uh, point is, is that uh, while people have been interested just because they're Pokemon binders and um, they're, they're cool to use, I just have plenty of them, <laughs> um, the... The shipping cost on them is way too high uh, to be reasonable. Like the binders themselves, um, I think because of their damage, aren't valued any more than about five dollars. But to ship these things costs fifteen, um, just because they're so bulky and they well. Um, I think the uh, binders themselves usually about ten. Um, but I found that if I use a flat rate. Um, uh, service and uh, basically I can throw in as much as I can uh, fit I believe up to 20 pounds I think I can ship um, we can ship everything for 17 so what I was thinking is that I would just kind of make a bunch of, uh, of, of lots where this is all I believe flash fire through roaring skies so they're all common uncommons uh, there should not be any duplicates um, I, I might have messed up uh, if I do if you do see anything anywhere where I've messed up and included duplicates just let me know um, but basically these are all Pokemon no trainers um, so you know these aren't really for players this is just kind of for um, just a fun collection but uh, most of the common and uncommon Pokemon cards from flash fire to roaring skies so that's um, five sets I believe uh, it's over 250 cards I believe um, now the counts in the binders are, are off, I think, by a margin of five. Um, I have some uh, where I only had, you know, a, a one or two copies of a card and I couldn't quite get five split sets. Um, I believe you are actually getting around 276 cards, um, give or take a few, but uh, I, I very easily could have miscounted uh, trying to go through these. So I'm going to just say 250 plus. Uh, and that should cover any errors on my end. Um, now the binder pages you might be able to tell are kind of old too. Um, oh look, here's Bernie. Um, so as you can see, he's uh, uh, booging quite a, quite a way. Um, we're actually going to get you off of the cards though. Um, luckily the brace isn't sharp so that actually doesn't damage anything since they're in sleeves, but still. As you can see, um, we're on a table pretty high off the ground. Uh, thanks to that brace, um, he's been able to use his leg more to support himself, been able to jump, which isn't always really a good thing. He gets into more mischief that way, as you can see. Um, anyways, so you got to see him boogie a little bit. Um, back to the card. So guaranteeing at least 250, no trainers, no duplicates. Um, pretty much very close to common, uncommon sets. Um, I haven't gone through and picked out playable cards, like uh, right there, there's Bunnelby. I believe um, some of the lots will see Joltix and uh, Lampints and uh, cards like that. Um, oh, so you can kind of see the, the damage on this binder other than just being pen marks. Um, this little clip doesn't quite align. I believe one of these binders too um, like you can get it to reline, but then it pops out really quick. So just um, minor damage where the binders are still functional, but because I'm constantly taking them on and off the shelves, um, they were just getting more and more damage. And I, I really think that um, these would be a little better for just someone's personal 
uh, collection, something that may not be <laughs> removed from the shelf, you know, 10, 15 times a day. Um, now I can go through if, if someone is just interested in seeing another lot, but these should be, you know, like I said, within five cards of each other, the, very, the exact same. Um, so the entire lot uh, is $35. So that covers the cost of the binder, the all, all the cards, um, and the shipping costs. And again, you know, the, the shipping is just, is it's what's making this um, an expensive lot. So I was just kind of trying to give a little more incentive um, to make it worth it to pay the high shipping costs. Now, if you are interested in purchasing anything else, since these are going to be in flat rate boxes, um, it'd be very easy to add things on without have without you having to pay extra shipping costs. Um, so I'm just throwing that out there too. But uh, just like the first fundraiser, everything from this video will go straight to Bernie. Um, whether you know if, if for I can't imagine, you know, he should have a normal lifespan of 15 years, this being his only brace. I have a feeling he'll burn through uh, quite a few of them over the years. But assuming that, let's say, uh, we make too much or something like that, um, all, all money will go to his medical care. So um, thank you, everyone. I, I've just received such fantastic support and, and just... Uh, good thoughts and people really hoping that Bernie turns out great and uh, we're very happy to have him in our house. So I uh, hope to hear from everyone soon and thanks everyone for watching.